this quick video, I'm going to show you how to send and receive text messages from the ABR text marketing system. So first of all, by default, we created the uh, extension on the leads, contacts, and deals, deals, opportunities, transactions. Uh, this is installed here. Now, if you want to send and receive text messages from other modules, you can use the webbook that we provided to you, or of course, you can contact us and we will help you, absolutely. Now, whenever you go to any lead, contact, or opportunity, you will see on the left side that you have ABR communication and SMS history. If you will go to the ABR communication, you will be able to see here all the send and receive text messages. Let me go to one of the records that I do know that I send and received. And you can see the communication. Now, on top of that, you can see also the SMS history. By default, it's installed only with the time. I will click here on the small rectangle and I will add some more meaningful uh, fields, such as the from number, the to number, if it was a lead, if it was a contact, if it was a deal or opportunity, and also what was the message. So I think all those are important fields. And let's click on save. And now you can see that you have more meaningful information. Uh, usually you will not really need it because the information is coming anyway to the chat and the chat is a more convenient way to send messages and see them. But anyway, you can also see it as a logo. Whenever you want to send messages, you will just type them in the enter message. So let's say this is a new message. And when I am going to receive a message, let me just send it from my other machine. When I'm going to send it, it will be received here. So you see that, uh, first of all, so click reminded me that I just got a text message. And also here it will be refreshed after 30 seconds. But for now, I will just click on refresh just to speed things up. So this is one way to send and receive text messages. Another way, which is you know, people usually don't do it, but you can, you can go here to the new message under SMS history. You will need to type if the message is outgoing or incoming. So let's say that is outgoing. You will need to write here the phone number that you're going to call. You will need to type here the message and you will need to check mark that this is SMS and then you will need to send it to save. Once you're saving it, it will send a text message. The reason that I don't like this approach is because you have lots of things to type and this is not a common behavior. And this is why I'm not really focusing on that. Another option that uh, we added for mobile purposes, but you can also use it if you like, you can go to the Twilio ma manual message. You can write here whatever message that you have. Once you click on save, it will be sent to the person. So those will be the ways. Now we're also working right now on two more features. One will be a button that from here you will be able to send a text message using a template. And also another one that you will be able to select multiple records and then send them a template. Okay, so all those are in work and they will be ready for you relatively soon. Uh, 